A vast river of molten lava erupted from a mile-long fissure, or cleft in the ground, and headed for Vesmanier, the island's port. They named the cone Eldfell, or Fire Mountain. But a few weeks later, as the great 1,000-yard wide river of lava, moving at between three and nine yards a day, looked as if it might reach and destroy the fishing harbor, the main source of the town's livelihood, something had to be done. So, in a desperate attempt to stem the deadly flow, seawater was sprayed onto the river of molten rock to try and solidify it, or at least divert its relentless progress. Specialist pumping equipment was brought in from the US and a ship with the ability to direct vast amounts of water moved into the harbor. The operation in which nearly one and a half billion gallons of water was hosed non-stop onto the lava using 19 miles of pipe and 43 pumps lasted until early July 1973 when it was judged a success. A short time later with the harbor saved the inhabitants of Jaime began to return.